Hello friends, in this video I am going to discuss what how to perform group by and sorting in Alteryx. So add here this is the Alteryx designer. Now here first I am going to remove uh, this uh, workflow content. Now here after the next uh, here. So let's go to favorite and here in just to drag input data inside the workflow and here after I'm going to use the uh, add here connection or file name so that I'm going to use uh, one already created connection with Oracle and uh, here I'm going to use HR data HR database and here employees table so double click on the employees table and here after so this is all columns inside employees table now if I select a star and here a star that indicate all the columns are from the employees table so if I go on SQL editor so this is at here select a star from employees that indicate all the columns from employees table now here after let's click ok now here after go to reporting and here I'm going to drag report text so here or drag that now if I run here so or uh, there are 116 KB and here this is the query and here this is the record inside uh, the tables so add here uh, I'm going to make the group on the department ID and uh, here after that uh, according to department ID I'm going to do the field ranks so here going to calculate sum of salary mean salary max salary according to department Y so for this we need to use add here group by now here you can see this is Oracle SQL developer connected with the HR here employees table so this is all the contents inside the employees table now here after let's make that group so select add here or source now here after let's go at this place table or query click on triple dot now here let's make that bigger now here I'm going to uh, select some particular columns like uh, department ID that I'm going to use now make that in the group so if you check then uh, here you can see 19 one group 16 one group 100 one group so this will do the uh, grouping now here after let's click on ok now run the workflow so workflow runs successfully here you can see this so uh, here total or uh, here you can see 12 record it's a display that means so uh, all in one group like 10 in one group 20 in one group 30 in one group and or uh, this is not in the order okay order wise this is the random order so for this we need to click on the triple dot once again and here after the next uh, here you can see employees so this is the columns here you can select one and here after you can either make in ascending or descending so ascending order it's fine now here after so it's all fine now here after click on run now you can see 12 rows it's affected it's all in ascending order now here after uh, grouping part has been done so here after let's include some uh, columns so here I'm going to uh, calculate some of salary according to department wise so for this we need to check at here salary salary it's come there now automatically it's uh, taken group by now here after 
here I'm going to use so or sum of salary so sum and here so how's the code that work here this so 90 that make in one group so here 19 that uh, make in one group and that will do the summation like 24,000, 17,000, 17,000 like this uh, 16 make in one group and that do the calculation okay so since here I'm going to make order by department underscore id so let's execute to this query or depart depart p a r t department department now execute this query so here or 10 the sum of salary that will display 44,000 sorry 4420 that make in one group 13,000 plus 6,000 that display 19,000 now here let's go to Arctic designer here it's all looking fine here after or uh, you need to click on the run workflow and uh, workflow there is no any problems with the workflow here 10 or uh, 44 hundred twenty nineteen thousand and thirty twenty four thousand nine hundred so if you add uh, this uh, 30 part so here the sum of salary that uh, going to comes twenty four thousand nine hundred now here after uh, let's click once again triple dot so here if I go on the SQL query so here you can see this is the automatic query is generated so at here it's a selected department ID and here that doing the sum of salary and here as so this is the alias column alias and here or uh, from employees and that uh, doing the group by on department ID and making group by only in the department ID and here order by on the department ID so this is the query here so uh, let's uh, go triple dot once again and uh, here if you copy simply you should copy and uh, here you can just paste and execute the query so here you can get the same output okay here you can get the same output so that means it's uh, working correctly and uh, this is the way we can use add here or uh, group by and sorting so there is a uh, one important thing i just remember here i used to uh, or uh, some you can use the uh, various uh, aggregate function like uh, average now let's use average and execute so here that according to department wise that doing the average on the salary so 10 or uh, 4420 so like this you can use other aggregate function also so here we can use other aggregate function this is all aggregate function that uh, uh, regularly used in the artrex designer so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week